taking question number 3 of exercise 8.1 of the chapter application of integrals the question is like this find the area of the region bounded by x square is equal to 4y y is equal to 2 y is equal to 4 and the y axis in the first quadrant okay now to solve the question first of all we are we shall sketch the area required to be calculated okay now the given curve is x square is equal to 4y is actually a parabola whose standard form is x square is equal to 4ay and about this form it should be noted that the curve passes through origin it is symmetric about y axis and the curve is a, is made about the positive y axis because x square is equal to 4ay okay it passes through origin because it doesn't contain any constant term and it is symmetric about y axis because it contains a term of x square okay now the shape of the curve x square is equal to 4ay can be noted like this we take the coordinate axis and its shape would be somewhat like this okay x square is equal to 4ay okay now we have to consider this curve x square is equal to 4y so we can take the same curve to represent this curve also x square is equal to 4y okay so this is my curve x square is equal to 4y i have to calculate the area bounded by the parabola the line y is equal to 2 y is equal to 4 and y axis in the first quadrant so the area is required in the first quadrant okay the line y is equal to 2 is such a line that it is parallel to x axis and at a distance 2 from origin so i can make a line like this and represent it as y is equal to 2 and it is going to intersect the y axis at the point whose coordinates can be written as 0 comma 2 and marked as a similarly the second line can i can mark as y is equal to 4 and it is going to intersect y axis at the point b i say and i mark that it is equal to 0 comma 4 this point i mark as equal to c this point i mark as equal to d and i require this area this shaded portion okay now i see here that this curve is made along y axis so i am going to divide this curve into horizontal strips okay and each strip would be of thickness d by okay so the required area is first of all this area a b c d a this is the required area and i can divide it into these horizontal strips as i have suggested and if i take one of the strip like this actually the thickness again i am going to explain is this that thickness is of no importance because the thickness is infinitesimally small because its thickness is equal to dy so dy thickness suggests that the thickness is very 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 small it is equivalent to a line okay so 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 it can be considered as a rectangle whose uh, width is dy and its length length is from the y axis to the curve so this distance can be taken as equal to x okay so i can say that the area of this rectangle is equal to x dy so i can say that the area of any rectangular strip any sorry horizontal strip taken in the area a b c d a can be written as equal to x into dy right now x is equal to x square is equal to 4 pi so this means that x is equal to plus minus 2 into root y because i am integrating along positive axis so i am not going to take the negative sign so i am going to take x as equal to 2 root y so the area of the horizontal strip elementary horizontal strip can be taken as equal to 2 root y dy okay now what i have to do i have to calculate the area of all these strips which are going to form this area so for this what i am going to do i am going to integrate and i am going to integrate this from a to b so the required area a b c d a is equal to integration of 2 root y dy from the limits 2 to 4 we can integrate this very easily so i have written y is equal to uh, y root y is equal to y to the power of 1 by 2 okay all the terms as it is on integrating 
y to the power of 1 by 2, this, this will give me y to the power of 3 by 2 upon 3 by 2. Okay. Now I shall apply the limit, so I am going to get this as 4 by 3, upper limit 4, so 4 to the power of 3 by 2, minus 2 to the power of 3 by 2, so this is going to give me 8 minus 2 root 2, 4 by 3 outside the bracket, and this can be written as 1 by 3 times 32 minus 8 root 2 square units, which is actually my required answer. So this is how I am going to solve this question. Friends, thanks for watching my video to watch more of these super videos and for the latest updates subscribe and like the videos on these channels on youtube hsk shiksha and math help by hsk thank you